Right now, though, my next guest has made it to the finals of Dancing on Ice. To me, cancer is like a fire through the body and it burnt me to the ground and this is me coming back again. It was so raw and honest and as a performer, it was a ten. Not giving in. Based on that skate, I'm going to save Adele and Mark. Congratulations to Adele and Mark. Commiserations to Amber and Simon. And Adele joins me now. That all happened last night. And it's like, how are you after all that? Is it all it's exciting? <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. I can't believe I've come back to see you, Lorraine. And I'm I know. in the final. It's, it's amazing. Brilliant. It's, do you remember we were talking about this when you were first going to go on? And yeah. it was like, oh, this whole big, new, exciting thing. But you've just found something that you love so, so much. You can see it in every single routine that you do. You're having the time of your life. No, absolutely. I didn't think I'd be able to learn to skate or dance or perform or have hair and makeup. <laughs> it's been amazing. Amazing. <laughs> All of it. I mean, look at Adele. Look oh, wow. at you, wow. for the goodness sake. It's absolutely wonderful. And what a great partner you've got as well. Oh, I love Mark. Isn't he, he sends lovely? his love, by the way. He's just so lovely. You and you me. can tell you to, you, I mean, you have to trust him implicitly, don't you? And you, you, because he literally is holding <laughs> yeah, up. <laughs> totally, yeah. Yeah, so far, so good. Oh, it's dropped me. It's, it's absolutely brilliant. And of course, as well as that, there, there are three people in this relationship, aren't there? <laughs> yeah. Because there's Audrey the Stoma. Has Audrey the Stoma been behaving herself, Adele? She has, until I've yes. come here today. She's just been very cheeky. I don't know if you heard her off mic. There, oh, but that, yeah, was that her? making noises. She loves you. For goodness <laughs> sake. But what's been really good about this is when you're training and also when you were performing, we can you can see, you know, you can see your stomach. You can see Audrey. There she is. Yeah. And that is fantastic because anybody who's who, who has a stomach is going to go, wow, you can do that. Absolutely. That's Amazing. one of the reasons why I'm so happy to be on the show, just to show Ostomates what's possible, also to raise awareness of bowel cancer. And so, you know, every time that we get to skate, that's definitely in minor Mark's heart. Uh, like you can see there. That, I know. That's... That was a great routine. I loved that. I, I loved that. Was... Fabulous. But we just want to show people, yeah, that you know, you can, um, if lots of people are going through tough times, but you can get through them and you Absolutely. can keep going. Have you had, you and Mark, have you had to sort of make a few wee changes just because of the stoma? Because of, because you have to be careful over. Yeah, totally. It, my stoma, Audrey got caught on Mark's shoulder one time. So, oh, yeah. Lovely. <laughs> We've had our troubles. Happy days. Yeah. But sometimes he just has to manoeuvre me in a different yeah, way. To yeah, just up, yeah. because obviously you do have to work round. Absolutely. You know, you have to work round and make sure that everything <laughs> is okay. It's been a very very emotional time for you though because your your mum sadly died at the start of this year you've had all of that going on as well as a lot of expectation because you know we've all been so excited about you being in the show and um, it, it has been tough but you're mentally you are a tough girl yeah th thank you Lorraine yeah I, th I think I've just sort of like tried to do it for my mum because my mum was such a strong woman and she never let things get her down and so in her honour every time I go out to skate I know it's a privilege to still be alive to still be here and to um, yeah go again so that's my trophy you know no matter what happens in the final mm. I think me and Mark have done what we set out to do oh, so we're happy 100% you must have got great reaction though because we've already here, you know, we've had we've had parents saying that their children have got stomas and they're watching you and just like, it's like, wow, this is incredible. That again, that sort of feedback must be so encouraging. No, it absolutely is. Yeah. Like, uh, thank you to everyone that's been supporting us. Um, you, you're making me so happy. I didn't think <laughs> at the grand old age of 44. <laughs> I keep I'd forgetting be... you're 40, <laughs> but you look at 12. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's ridiculous. And it's going to be my birthday as well on Saturday, so I'll be 45. <gasps> so I think... 45? On the, oh, yeah, that is so, so lovely. Listen, we got you. We, we got Jack's. Jack has been up all night making this. Oh my God, <laughs> that's your first, that's you. your first birthday cake. Oh, wow, thank you so much. And you're much. allowed. You're allowed to. You're allowed to eat that, of course. So you're the last woman standing. Yeah, yeah. You're the last I'm the woman oldest standing. woman standing. I'll take it. I know yeah, it is awesome. wonderful. You're right. No matter what happens, although obviously we all want you to win, and we'll be voting again and again and again for you Thank to you. win. Of course we do. Um, but you're right in a way, you've kind of achieved what you wanted to, what you set out to do. Yeah, the moment my blade first touched the ice, that was my trophy. So anything is, is the cherry on the cake or the raspberry <laughs> on the cake. You know, yeah, anything above that is the raspberry on the cake. Very healthy cake. <laughs>
very, very healthy cake. <laughs> but you've worked so, so I cannot believe that this is just, you've just learned to do this incredible thing that I couldn't, I mean, I'd be wibbling around. I love that, the Matrix. Oh, I that love that one. That was so good. I don't know, that kind of, I think that might be my favourite. Have you got a favourite routine? Um, or did they know. all just... Great. I think the Matrix, like you I just really said, like yeah. That. It was like the whole outfit and everything. I, I asked, I'm going to see if I can keep that outfit. You, you know? must. <laughs> you must keep that and you must take and your way out for an evening. <laughs> yeah. And she can get one as well. Yeah. <laughs> Could you imagine? Just go around. Brilliant. And then a wee tiny one for, for Audrey the Stone Machine. That would be special. A wee special one. We are so proud of you. Thank you. We're all name. beside ourselves and we're so proud of you. I'm so glad that you very deservedly get through to the final. Thank you. And fingers crossed. I can't wait to see what you two are going to come up with. Thank you. Well, I mean, we'll do just, something special for you. It just gets better and better and better every week. <laughs> it's such a spectacle. And it's such a joyful show as well. It's yeah. just lovely. Absolutely. Thank you so, so much, my love. And you can eat all that cake. Oh, thanks. Because you're so tiny, you need to eat. <laughs> and the Dancing on Ice final, it's on Sunday at half past six.